Yeah, here we go. The day we're putting the shelves and doors and back in the cabinets, those put in. He's working on that one. We got through with that one. And there's an extra shelf on the very top just for storage in case our extra in case I need it. I can always rearrange those shelves if I need to once I start packing stuff back in, this, in there. They all know what space I need. I can move those. It's got all these to go. It's like putting the puzzle back together. Alright, that's great. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I've moved the, those around in that cabinet about a couple years ago. Normally, when, I don't find them on the countertops, but these are getting replaced. They're getting, yeah, they're getting thrown out. Who cares? <laughs> yeah, a few years ago, I made that bottom space bigger for me because I, so I could put more stuff in it that I could use all the time, that I reach all the time. I had it too high where I couldn't reach it. Gotta get you them go go gadget boots. <laughs> go go gadget legs. <sighs> I wish I had some. Well, but these that on the very top, I got one of those little one step, just a little step, like still step on. I can usually reach the top with that. Reach it best way you can. You know what? Mm. It's hard to reach stuff when you're short, but I bump my head a lot less than other people. That's true. <laughs> my husband does that all the time, bump his head on stuff. <laughs> and the funny part, he'll bump it on the same stuff all the time like he forgets it's there. The stuff is still there. <laughs> reach your head. I seen my helper hit his head on that a few times here. Yeah. Uh huh. Yep. Uh, I tell my life picture has it moved. It's still in the same spot all the time. <laughs> Josh is so tall. He hits his head all the time. I bet. Yeah. Uh huh. It's even taller than Josh. Tall. Oh gosh. Josh mm -hmm. looked up at him a little bit. Yeah. And, Shoot. Uh, that guy is always hitting his head. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Call him Tall Paul. Huh. I worked with a guy one time named Paul. That was Tall. We called him that too, Tall Paul. It just fits. Uh, one funny thing about one funny thing I remember about this Tall Paul I worked with. He liked to eat bananas, but he wouldn't eat a banana unless it was almost solid black for you to eat it. He liked to eat it like that. No, not, I don't like the regular bananas like that. Yeah. I lived in Florida. We had like 800 banana trees in my yard. Wow. But they were the, the, the apple bananas. Okay, the yeah. And you let those get real ripe, and mm -hmm. they're so good. So hmm. good. Yeah, you try to eat them when they're yellow, they're kind of like bitter. I don't think they even sell those up here. Never see them. No, I don't see them around here. Mm. Um, pe people were always running up in my yard, snatching bananas. Yeah. I'm like, you don't have to run. I got plenty of them. You can have <laughs> them. You can have them, yeah. Uh. This, and and the, the flower that blooms at the end of the banana bunch. Yeah. Um, Latinos use it in their cooking. Okay. And they were always after them flowers and were like, well. Yeah. You know, when you cut that flower off, it kind of ruins the bunch. Oh, you know, it does? The rest of the bananas don't ripen yeah. correctly. Oh, okay. We're putting stuff in. Uh, How you doing today, 
foot? Doing fine. Uh, well, we've got more shelves than we thought. We have remains these. Top shelf very much. No, I sure don't remember. It just looks odd with three shelves now. I don't remember being three in there like that. <laughs> got a lot of extra. I got two more. Yeah, that's, yeah. They gotta go there. We have any other place to put them. We yeah. find. Oh, I can see too. Yeah, we took dozens of pictures of the outside. Never thought to take a picture of the inside of the cabinet. Crooked spot. I still haven't heard from Tim yet. Really? Yeah. I need to check on mine about that today. Maybe he's heard anything when he's going to come out. Mm. Mm hmm. Might have to rebuild the, completely rebuild the door. Mm. I'm not sure yet. I got them out in the trailer and bring them in here and check all that out. Yeah. Does the bed hood go in after you paint the wall up there? Huh? Does the bed hood go in after you paint the wall? Um, Maybe if you get to the, the wall. The bed hood's got to go in and then you tile up to it. The backsplash is going right there, right? Yeah, I'm just talking about it being if you get to that wall of paint up there, the bed hood wasn't there. I know if you're going to paint before you put it in. I was going to, all the bare drywall is going to get primer put on it. I meant the wall above it. Oh, up here? Yeah, that wall. <laughs> oh. These will get to it down the bed hood there, sticking out. Uh, oh, the bed hood doesn't, how far does it stick out? I don't know. Three, four, inches. Uh, about four or five inches. Uh, I still don't know if I'm the one installing that. Yeah. The electrician. Yeah. Ah. It's kind of an electrical deal. Yeah, it is. these back in. We have them all packed nicely. They don't scratch each other, didn't you? Mm -hmm. Perfectly. Perfect. I don't want to spend all that time and effort. No. Making them look pretty just to scratch them up. <laughs> no, uh uh. Looks like they'd be good there. Hey, it looks good, yeah. I think looks so. About, looks about good and even. I think so, yeah. Mm -hmm. All the shelf in, and we're going to throw on the doors next. Or the doors, either one. The doors are doors. Uh, we will come back when he's all through for now. And he's got. We'll put the doors on next because the hard the drawers take hardware. He's got to put it back on. So we're going to skip over to the doors. They saved the doors for last. All the doors have been numbered or lettered so they know that where they go. <laughs> Guess it's good you put everything right back in the hole it was in, right? Makes it a little easier. It is real important because 
there are a lot of teeny tiny little adjustments uh -huh. on each one to make them all line up right. Mm. I mean, you could just throw hinges any which way you want. Yeah. But you'd have to do all that adjusting. <laughs> yeah, make them close just right and fit just right. We're close for now, and I'll, you'll see a picture of how it's all through at the end. That would be my thumbnail once he's done. He's got quite a bit more work. Putting in hardware. We're closed for now. Goodbye, everyone. God bless.